50. That's what they decided. Those pot smoking, Mr. Min snuffing parents of mine. I knew it were drugs. I knew it were drugs. It had to have been drugs. You know how I know? Because I grew up with some physical defects. Not this. <laughs> this. Look how far my eyes are in the back of my head. We have to have special lights so you can see my eyes. <laughs> Look how deep set my eyes are. People at the back like, why is the comedian got nothing on us? So my eyes are deep set. You know when a guy goes like this? I don't need a block. <laughs> Rest of the comedians will come out tonight, they go, Hey, Joburg, how are you? Wow, this light's bright. I'm fine. <laughs> I can see all of you. Born with a gazebo. <laughs> so, gentlemen, there, there's a term that has been hijacked by perverts. I mean, I, I consider myself somewhat of a gentleman. So, I went to a gentleman's club. I thought, oh, I'll go down there and have some grammatically correct conversation with him. You know, maybe, I'll, maybe I'll swirl a brandy balloon around and smoke a cigar. This is going to be great. No, no, no. Evidently now, gentleman just means lonely deviate sitting in a dark room staring at a bunch of nude women whose dads never took it with netball. It's, it's disgusting. I'm single. I am single, I've been trying to meet someone through online dating and I love online dating as you can be really, really specific and type in exactly what you're looking for in a potential partner. Anyone, enter. But I registered with Match.com, not one date. And I wrote to the CEO, I said, what the hell's going on? I've been with Match.com for, for like two years, not one date. He said, I'm sorry, Ms Loeb, but there's nobody compatible with your personality. I thought, that's impossible. I've got so many personalities to choose from. I'm, um, I'm not autistic, <laughs> but I do have to say that a lot, so I don't know what that means. <laughs> but I figured out though, I, I figured out why I'm like this. I, um, I went to a very nerdy school, I went to a very nerdy high school, like everyone was, there was a big nerd. So there was no, uh, there were no like bullies at all, there were no jocks of any kind. And I think that kind of explains my vibe, because I've got the confidence of someone who wasn't bullied in high school, but the demeanour of someone who must have been. <laughs> Thank you.